Hello and welcome to the training course on function point analysis that is FPA based software estimation. Let us look at the course outline. We will have introduction, then we will look at the function point history, then we will look at function point variations, then we will try to know about the problems associated with lines of code based software estimation. We will then understand what are function points. We will try to know the objectives behind using of function points. We will then see how do function points overcome lines of code based software estimation related problems. We will then look at the various uses of function points. We will then understand when should you count function points. We will also look at who should count function points. We will then understand the process of function point counting and we will then look at an example on function point counting. So let us now look, begin with the introduction. Software estimation is a very very important area in the software project management. It is that area in the software engineering which if it is not done effectively can cause problems in having unrealistic cost and schedule. There are many methods available to do the software estimation. There are work breakdown structure WBS based software estimation method. There is a software estimation method called use cases based estimation. There is a lines of code based software estimation method and there is a function point analysis based software estimation. Software estimation helps in determining the software size which in turn helps to determine the overall project size which then help in determining the project schedule and the project cost. As it is mentioned here increasingly important facet of software development is the ability to estimate the associated cost of development early in the development process. Estimating software size is a difficult pro problem that requires specific knowledge of the system functions in terms of scope, complexity, interactions. So we talked about few of the software estimation methods such as work breakdown structure. Now these are these are the estimation methods which you can use if your software projects are simple in nature. So there are certain projects which are scope intensive in which the scope is also not very clear. It is complex and it has got lot of interactions or integrations with the third party systems. This is where the software estimation methods like lines of code and function point analysis based software estimation methods are very effective and hence most frequently cited sources of software size metrics are lines of code and function point analysis. Now let us look at the history involved in the function points evolvement. Function point based software estimation method. It was developed by Alan Albrecht in the late 1970s while he was working at IBM. The function point technique was refined and a counting manual was produced by IBM's guide organization in the early 1980s. The International Function Point Users Group IFPUG was founded in the late 1980s and produced its own counting practices manual. In 1994 IFPUG produce release 4.0 
of its counting practices manual. The function point counting practices manual 4.1 was released in 1999. So this is the current version of the IFPUG based function point counting practices manual. Now International Function Point Users Group IFPUG is an international body works extensively on the function points based software estimation guidelines. So let us know about the IFPUG exactly what is its purpose what are the benefits they offer to the international community and the utilization. So the purpose of IFPUG is to promote and encourage use of function points. Its purpose is also to develop consistent and accurate counting guidelines. It offers various benefits such as it helps in networking with other count countries. It helps in maintaining IFPUG counting practices manual. It helps with various research projects. It provides for hotline to get the help associated with the uses of the function points. You can also receive newsletters on a frequent on a periodic basis from IFPUG and you can also achieve certification in function points based software estimation from IFPUG. About its utilization, its member companies include all industry sectors. So though it is a software estimation technique and methodology, its uses in the software project estimation across different industry verticals. It has over 1200 members in more than 30 countries. Now let us look at the next topic like what are different variations to the function point techniques. The first one was MK2 function points. In this they discovered weaknesses in Albrecht's approach then there was another variation to the function point called feature points here they found out that function points were not working for all classes of applications and that is how this particular variation was developed so another variation called 3d function points which was then designed to solve two problems which were there with Albrecht's approach. So these are certain variations to the function points.